everyone. My name is Eduardo. I'm a CS major here at Stanford, and I work as an assistant technical director at TAP. I've worked mostly uh, setting up the sound system for the walls, um, so uh, I'm just going to show a bit of what I've been working on. Um, just before we get started with all this, we uh, I just wanted to tell you guys a little bit about the sound, like the microphone system uh, that we have set up. We have six microphones uh, distributed evenly across the stage so that we can hear uh, every actor all the time while, while they're running around. And the way we've designed it is uh, just allows us to have directionality uh, to make sure that if someone's on the left side of the stage, the sound's actually coming from the left. That way we give like some like sense of like spaciousness, right? Um, but the other cool thing that we've done with sound for this uh, show is actually uh, created like a fake Bluetooth speaker. Um, originally, we were planning to use um, like a, just a normal Bluetooth speaker such as this, but we found that the range for Bluetooth wasn't quite at what we wanted it to be, and we also found that it was a bit uh, like there was a bit of a delay. So we decided to actually create our own Bluetooth speaker of sorts. Um, we've, we did th we've done that by uh, just purchasing a Bluetooth speaker that. Um, uh, has a audio jack, and we're going to be using what uh, we call IEMs. An IEM is basically uh, what is used by musicians so that they can hear themselves during concerts. Um, so we're going to take advantage of, uh, of the fact that uh, we can have an audio jack connected to the speaker, and we're going to just use uh, that output from the musician's like earpiece as our output, uh, as our input for the speaker. So we're going to turn on the, the NEM monitor. We're going to connect it. And then we're just going to close it and hide it away. The, the antenna is dangling outside, but this is actually fine because um, the speaker is so far away that nobody's going to notice that. Um, and then, yeah, just like that, in a couple seconds, we have our own custom Bluetooth speaker. Uh, well, now we're just going to quickly demo uh, how the Bluetooth speaker sounds and how we're mixing it into the rest of the speaker system in the uh, thing. So this uh, this is the scene where it's week three starts. So uh, we have some music playing on the background that immediately when the scene starts, starts to cross fade into the speaker. And that's it. Yeah, we have to actually mute the rest of the uh, speaker, the microphone array, because otherwise we can't really tell it's coming from the speaker. Um, we do that using a mute. But yeah, that's that's basically it.